Eversource customers are fed up after receiving their latest costly electric bill in the mail. We've been hearing a lot about this. Oh yeah, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Olivia Schuler has the details of a news conference being held by state Republicans later today. At 1145 this morning, that is when GOP lawmakers are going to meet meeting at the legislative office building to talk about electric rates. It comes after Connecticut residents stress their concerns and frustrations over these, their recent Eversource electric bills that came in the mail. Now our I team has been flooded with emails from people across the state with copies of their electric bills. One woman says her bill went from $219 to 548. Another person says the public benefits portion of her bill increased $124. Talk about sticker shock. Lawmakers hear individuals concerns and most of them want to do something about it. Representative Jonathan Steinberg with the Energy and Technology Committee says 77% of the public benefit increase comes from the Millstone nuclear contract, a bipartisan agreement signed in 2017. Steinberg says COVID relief funds cannot be used in any way to combat the costly bills. However, State Senator Jeffrey Gordon argues the money could be used. No, we can't because it, we, there's a, an appropriate separation between electric rates and the general budget. We could actually use that to help either pay for this or defray the cost. And some people have even advocated, do we even need to use any surplus funds that we have? Most of the American Rescue Plan money has been allocated for. However, Gordon says that the legislature should call for a special session so that they can figure out ways to combat this rise in electric rates. Now, once again, the meeting will be happening at 1145 at the Legislative Office Building. In Berlin, Olivia Schuler, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. The 